Hello and welcome back to another video. This problem, we're told that the range of the polynomial function f is the set of real numbers less than or equal to 4. We're also told that the zeros of f are negative 3 and 1, and we're asked of our options here, which of the following could be the graph of y equals f of x, given what we've already been told about it. So if we're told that the range, which is the y values of f, is the set of real numbers less than or equal to 4, that means that we're going to have some maximum value for f, then everything else for f is going to be below that point. And if we see, a has a maximum right here. And if we see, it is equal to y is equal to 4. So all of our values of, um, all of our y values for f in this graph are less than or equal to 4. Same thing here. That is our maximum value. Everything else is either less than or equal to it. For c, we have a minimum point. That means our range is going to be this value, which looks like it's negative 4. And then everything, all of our, our range is going to be that number and everything greater than or equal to. And then if you look at this, we have no bound on the lower version, or on the lower limit, or the upper limit. So the range is just all real numbers. It goes from here to positive infinity and from there to negative infinity. So C and D, their range is not... Um, all the numbers are less than or equal to 4, right? Um, so we are down to a and b, and our other information is that we're told the zeros of f are negative 3 and 1. So what are the zeros? Well, the zeros are the x-intercepts, right? So where does the line or the curve intersect the x-axis? And for a, we can see that it's at that negative 1, 2, 3, and positive 1, right? It's just the x value when y is equal to 0, so negative 3 and 1. And here, it's at the origin, so 0, and 1, 2, 3, 4. So the zeros of a are negative 3 and 1. The zeros of b are 0 and 4. So a is going to be your final answer. As always, thank you for liking and subscribing, and I'll see you in the next video.